Hi guys, welcome back to another video on the channel. No only cast night today, that game against Southampton has been postponed. Thank God, by the way, I could not be bothered to go down to Southampton today. But instead, we're here at Bly for Derby Day against Gateshead. I'm looking forward to this one. I'm in the away end. I'm here as a Gateshead fan. Always back Eddie Howe and Mike Williams in my words go. But in terms of this game, though, last time I watched Gateshead, I was against Charlton. They battered Charlton and they lost 2 0. They just couldn't take the chances. But since then, I've looked at the table. They've been progressing quite well now. On paper, this should be an easy win, but it is Derby Day. Anything can happen on Derby Day, especially away at Bly. The Bly fans, I imagine, will, yeah, will be up for this one. Guess I just got to settle down well, control the game, and this should be all right, but you never know. But anyway, guys, you're new to the channel. Make sure you hit that now, subscribe, smash like, enjoy. Appreciate the support as always. Next week, we've got Newcastle against Cambridge FA Cup, the women's game, and the 23 in the space of three days. So, a lot of football. Make sure to subscribe for that daily uploads as well. And without further ado, let's get into it. There we are, guys. We are via the Cruyff Park now. Love the mule there. The fish and chip shop. Gotta wait that quite a bit. But anyway, without further ado, let's get inside the stadium now. This is what we are for away days of live. I'm about the burger van. Love that. There was the man who once got a clean sheet away at Old Trafford and a 1 0 win. Love Mike Winnie's while legend here. On the bench today, but well, he's still got it. So the stadium's looking for today. High attendance in terms of the way on. Big chance for Blythe might have been all over Gates and that's a decent play going here. It has to go in the box now. Go on, get it. Great such strike early on. No, it's one though. Fucking Bly on the counter. Oh, defender's shrugging him off. Oh, he's had him there to be fair. Oh, that's a really good play by Bly, that. Oh, that, that was a stunning goal to be fair. Getting right in the gate, said Grace there. Uh, oh, that's going to wind fans up. That was a great goal by Bly. Yeah, well, you can tell this is a Toby. Oh, yeah. I think that was a penalty for us. That was a really bad tackle. I think I do agree with that. Huge chance of life. That'll go 2 1 up. And Bobby Deal live up to the pressure. There he comes. There he is. That's experience. Uh, that is 30 years experience in the game. Oh, Bobby Dale using 50 balls. Let's go for the next shot. This is too easy, but I look at the options about that left hand side there. Uh, that's crazy, that. He's, he's been had as well. Oh, that, that's shocking defending that left hand side there. Uh, that should be a goal. Uh. I've got to sort this out. Someone went on the pitch, great way to tell him about it, that was a correct choice. We need it first. <laughs> Band just got taken off there. We expect the Robbie Deal, by the way, came out to the away end straight away. Yes, this is a job where human lives come first, so I expect him must be doing that. Hopefully, the fan recover soon. It's crazy to see that happening in so much football games out. Big chance for Blythe, what a save that is. Game changing save that. 2 1 down, he's came out with that. 1-2-1 down, I'll tell you got a chance on a 3-1, they would have been completely out of it. Huge save. There it is, half 1-2-1 one, one, Blythe. Good game of football. There it is, Blythe at 2-1 over half time against Gateshead. I think Blythe deserves to be winning to be honest, I don't think Gates have been playing well so far. But again, the game's been overshadowed by medical emergency. 
Thankfully, the fan is okay now. As far as I'm aware, they've been speaking. the fine. Again, uh, I muted that clip when the fan ran the pitch because I thought it was a pitching video. I didn't think there was anything going on medical-wise. That was the correct choice by that fan. That probably would have saved the life, to be honest. Again, speaking personally, I have collapsed in a football game. It's like crazy. Admittedly, I had never needed any defibrillators or anything like that. But again, timing is everything in these sort of incidents. And it has to be dealt with straight away, which is why the fan ran out. Correct decision. And yeah, saved the life today. So fair play at that fan. Bobby Deal as well. Respect him coming over. It's happening so much of football games now, it's crazy. I've seen it about three or four times this season. It, oh, it's terrible. Yes, seeing the Watford game happen again, it, it's been happening all the time. Most important part is safety. Everyone needs to be safe at these games. Oh. Yeah, uh, enough about that. So let's get into the second half now. The most important part is the fan is all right. Now, Gates, I got a focus on trying to win this game, but it's still a game to be won here. Big free kick for Gates, then. Should we be doing something with this? Dodgy defending there. It's a ball. Go on. Oh, yes! Got it! Oh, he's offside. Oh, he's offside. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, Nelly. I don't think I was offside. That would have been so tight. Ball out. Oh, oh, oh. oh. That's a lucky that. One of these gems. One has taken. One has to go in now. Oh dear. That might have been the final one there. Last chance for Gates then. Oh, have a shot, has to go. Oh, he slipped. He's still got it. He's still got it. What's going on? He's still got the ball. Go on. At the back stick. Oh. Oh, and he's given a head injury as well. Oh, <laughs> that was a 50 50. It's not one with that. That was a 50 50. No, that's good. That's a little bit of fun. The most hated football player in the Gates and fan base. Oh, look at him laughing. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Oh, he, lo he loves winding the fans up him. I gotta wait. It. Yeah, it's full time. I mean, I, I can't believe Gates have lost that game. Mental. Oh, just over 2,000 fans today. I mean, support wise, good. Supporting on league teams. Oh, oh Gates had a, let's be honest, the fault with that game I felt like today. No, it is full time, Blyth at 1 2 1. I can't believe how many chances Gator had again and not took the exact same situation the Charlton game. You don't take chances, you don't win games. I think they deserve something today. I do feel like in the second half they were much better. Just why did they not play on the first half? We want to continue to swap your goals. I mean, I don't know who that Blyth player is. I love my 10, but I love his antics. He's one of them sort of players you love to hate. I mean, I've got to wait that behaviour from him. But in terms of that game itself, I mean, uh, we did the best I could, but it was just one of them with nothing but gates heads away. That's huge punch draft for them, you know, they should have got some that game. I think a draw would have been an, even a decent result for them. Losing that game, consider a one and up. It's not good enough, I feel like, Percy. But again, I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Next vlog, of course, we'll be back again next week. Take care, guys.